Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn Class 7, SEM 2, Chapter 5, Area of Plane Figures, Exercise 5.2. See now question number 1. The length and breadth of the tablet are 16 cm and 8 cm respectively. It has a inner side black border of 1 cm width around the screen. Find the area of the black border. Let us see the solution. The length of the tablet they have given as 16 cm and breadth of the tablet they have given as 8 cm. For tablet there is a black border having width 1 cm. So width of black border is 1 cm we have written. So border is running around the screen. In middle this is the screen. E of G H is the screen of the tablet and black border is around the screen length of the screen e of gh we are going to find so we have taken length of the tablet that is 16 centimeter minus here both sides we are having 1 centimeter width so minus 2 into width so we have written here length 16 centimeter minus 2 into width they have given 1 centimeter that equals to 16 minus 2 into 1, 2. So, 16 minus 2, 14 centimeter. Therefore, length of the screen we got now 14 centimeter. Length of the tablet is 16 centimeter, but length of the screen is here 14 centimeters we got now. Next, we shall find breadth of the screen and area of the screen. Then, after we have to find area of this tablet. If we subtract those both, we will get the area of this black border. See now, breadth of screen, E of G H we are going to find. So, breadth is here 8 cm minus 2 times width here 1 cm and here also 1 cm, 2 times width. So, we have taken here breadth 8 cm minus 2 into width is 1 cm. That equals to 8 minus 2 into 1, 2. So, 8 minus 2, that is 6 cm. Therefore, we got breadth of the screen as 6 cm. Therefore, area of this screen, E of G, H, that is, it is in the shape of rectangle. So, area formula is length into breadth. That equals to 14 into 6 cm. 14, 6, 84. Therefore, area of screen is 84 square centimeter. Next, we are going to find area of tablet A, B, C, D. It is also in the shape of rectangle. So, we have taken formula length into breadth. That is 16 into 8. That is 128 square centimeter. Now, we have to find the area of the black border. So, this border area we have to find. To find that, we have to subtract area of screen from area of tablet so area of the black border equals to area of tablet that is a b c d minus area of screen e of g h that equals to area of tablet we got here 128 square centimeter minus area of screen is 84 square centimeter 128 minus 84 that is 44 square centimeter therefore area of the black border is 44 square centimeter. See now question number 2. Ravant has a rectangular lawn of length 45 meters and breadth 20 meters in his garden. He wants to do flooring 5 meters along outside the lawn for path. Find out the area of path. Find the cost of flooring at the rate 100 rupees per square meter. So, there is a rectangular shaped lawn having length 45 meters and breadth 20 meters. And there is a path around the lawn having width 5 meters. Now, we have to find the area of this path. Now, we are going to find the length of PQRS that is length of outer lawn. That is nothing but length of rectangular lawn plus 2 times this width that is they have given 5 meters on both sides so length of outer lawn equals to length plus 2 times width that equals to length of rectangular lawn is 45 meters plus 2 times width here width is 5 meters so 2 into 5 
that equals to 45 plus 2 5s are 10. 45 plus 10 that is 55 meters. Therefore, length of outer side lawn is 55 meters. Now, we have to find the breadth of outer lawn. Then after we have to find its area. Next, we also must find area of rectangular lawn. When we subtract these both areas, we will get the area of path. Then after we have to find the cost of flooring. See now, breadth of outer lawn, that is, breadth of the rectangular lawn plus 2 times width. So, breadth 20 meters plus 2 into width 5 meters. That equals to 20 plus 2 is 10. So, 20 plus 10, 30 meters. Therefore, breadth of outer lawn is 30 meters. Now, we are going to find the area of PQRS, that is, outer lawn. It is in the shape of a rectangle, so the formula is length into breadth that equals to 55 into 30 meters. That equals to 55 into 30 that is 1650 square meters. Now we are going to find the area of KLMN that is area of inner lawn. It is also in the shape of a rectangle, so the formula is length into breadth. That equals to length is 45 meters into Breadth is at 20 meters that equals to 45 into 20 that is 900 square meters. Now we are going to find the area of the path that is area of outer rectangle minus area of inner rectangle that is outer area minus inner area that equals to area of outer lawn is 1650 minus area of inner lawn is 900 square meters. 1650 minus 900 that is 750 square meters. Therefore, we got here area of the path is 750 square meters. They have given in the question cost of flooring per square meter is 100 rupees. Therefore, cost of flooring per 750 square meters is 750 into 100 that is 75,000 rupees. Therefore, cost of flooring per 750 square meters is 75,000 rupees. See now question number 3. The surface of water pool is in the shape of a square whose side is 450 centimeter. Its exterior 20 centimeter width edge part is cemented along the side of the square. Find the area of that cemented part. Find cost for cementing if the rate is 15 rupees per square centimeter. See here, this is the square shaped pool having sides of 450 centimeter. Outer part of the pool is cemented and it is having width 20 centimeter each. Let us see the solution given inner side of the pool is 450 centimeter. Next, width of edge is 20 centimeter. Now we are going to find Area of water pool that is A, B, C, D. Here the given water pool is in the shape of square. So we have to take area of square formula that is side into side. We denoted here S into S. That equals to 450 into 450. Now we have to do multiplication. Here two zeros were there. So keep here two zeros. Now we are going to multiply 45 into 45. Today I am going to show you how to do quick multiplication of numbers ending with 5 and your first digits when they are same. 5 fives are 25. Next when these two digits were same, how to multiply means here 4 is there, 4 next number 5. So 4 fives are 20. So 45 into 45, quick multiplication answer is 2025. Write down here 2025. Therefore, area of water pool is 2,2500 square centimeter. Now, we have to find the outer side area. Then after, we have to find the area of the cemented part and its cost for cementing. See now here, the part is running outside the pool. So, outer side of the pool is side plus 2 times width that equals to side is 450 centimeter plus 
width is 20 cm so 2 into 20 that equals to 450 plus 2 times 20 40 so 450 plus 40 that is 490 centimeter therefore outer side of the pool is 490 centimeter next we have to find area of outer side that is EFGH that equals to side into side that is 490 into 490 that equals to 49 into 49 is 2401 so we have written 2401 here last two zeros here we added so the answer is 240,100 square centimeter now we have to find the area of the cemented part that is area of outer side minus area of water pool that equals to area of outer side we got here 2,40,100 minus area of water pool previously we got 2,2,500 now let us do subtraction 2,40,100 minus 2,2,500 so 0 minus 0, 0 again 0 minus 0, 0 1 minus 5 we can't do subtraction so let us borrow from 4 here this 1 becomes 11 and this 0 becomes 9 and 4 becomes 3. So 11 minus 5, 6, 9 minus 2, 7, 3 minus 0, 3, 2 minus 2, 0. Therefore area of the cemented part of the pool is 37,600 square centimeter. They have given cost of cementing. Let us find that now. See now, cost of cementing per square centimeter they have given as 15 rupees. Therefore, cost of cementing per 37,600 square centimeter that is 37,600 into 15. 15 zeros are 0, 15 zeros are 0, 15 six are 90, 0 carry 9. Next, 15 sevens are 105. 105 plus 9, 114. So write down 4, you will get a carry 11. Next, 15 threes are 45. 45 plus 11, that is 56. Therefore, cost of cementing per 37,600 square centimeter is 5,64,000 rupees. Today, we have seen class 7, sum 2, chapter 5, area of plane figures, exercise 5.2, 1 to 3 sums. In our next video, we shall see remaining sums of this exercise. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.